We're at Universal Studios Florida for GFW Impact Wrestling TV tapings. This referee needs no introduction, but I'm gonna give him one anyway. One of the best all-time referees, still going strong. He is a Impact Wrestling Hall of Famer, Mr. Earl Hebner. Thank you, Earl, so much for taking some time. What was it like for you being a part of Slammiversary 15? 15 years the company has been on going and still going. That was one of the best ones we've ever been in, ever had. It just ran like a train and we had so much excitement. I called it the Slam Slammiversary Variety Show because we had so many different uh, countries and people wrestling in it and it was just really amazing. Earl, all the years have been refereeing. How many years has it been now? I've been uh, close to 40, 38, 39 or 40. It's, it's close to 40. Does My any, age. Does, any, <laughs> does anything surprise you anymore? Yeah, I get surprised every day uh, in, in the ring. Uh, different things happen that, that, that occur and you're not expecting them. And, and, and it's just one of those things where you, you get a lot of surprises in the, in the ring. <laughs> Your son's a referee. Brian Stifler's here, you have Robert King, you got a assortment of referees that are here. Tell us something about the referees. Well, we have good referees. Every referee that's with the TNA is really, really good. They work hard and they, they, they know what they're supposed to do and they're on the ball at all times in every match. Tell us how it makes you feel that your son's been able to do it as long as he's been able to do it and do a great job that he's been doing. It makes me feel good. Then again, it makes me feel bad because it looks like it's me in there, but I can't go like him anymore. I'm, <laughs> I'm, I, I can only do so much now, I'm running out of gas. <laughs> what have you enjoyed most about doing what you do? I've enjoyed having the opportunity to travel around the world many, many times. I enjoy working with all these guys. And this is just a job that you either love it or hate it. And if you don't like it, then it's time to move on. And like I said, 40 years, I'm gone nowhere, so I'm still here, so I'm, I don't like it. I love it. I also noticed that even before matches, you're there interacting with fans. It's just a comfortability that you have when you're out there with the wrestlers in the ring and the fans outside the ring? Yeah. I mean, the fans are great. Without the fans, we wouldn't have, we wouldn't have a wrestling business. So they, you know, we have some hard, hard, uh, how do you say it? Uh, hardcore fans? Hardcore fans, and we have some fans. But... Uh, the fans are great, uh, you know, they just treat all the guys, whether you're a good guy or a bad guy, I really believe they love them all. Earl, it's so many matches you've done, do you have a number or more than this that you know how many matches that you've actually refereed? Not really, uh, I don't think a calculator will go up that far. <laughs> I think it's infinity, right? Yeah, uh-huh, yeah. <laughs> all right, Earl. Hey, Earl, do you have social media? No, I don't have Facebook. No. <laughs> no Twitter, no Facebook, none of that. I got uh, Instagram and uh, I got Facebook. Earl Hebner, thank you so much. Thank you so much and thank you to all the fans that have supported TNA and Impact and, and we really appreciate your, your support. Well said.